Hello! This is my video for the My Favorite Mega Number video playlist. My Favorite Mega Number is Bell Figures Prime. And Numberphile actually already has a great video on this that you guys should go watch that I'll try to link below. I'm not even really adding any information to that video. Um, I did do independent research, it's just that they covered it pretty fully. But I couldn't imagine not doing Bell Figures Prime. So Bell Figures Prime is part of a larger number sequence called the palindromic Belfigur numbers. As you might have imagined, all of the numbers in that sequence are palindromes. I know, I know, where are my smelling salts? <laughs> and the sequence is also named after one of the seven princes of hell. And that's because all of the numbers in that sequence, all of the numbers in that sequence uh, have 666 dead center right in the middle. This is the formula. So for example, the first number in that sequence, n equals zero, is right there. And it's actually also a prime, as well as other numbers further in the sequence, but none of them have the coveted title of Bell Figures Prime. So n equals 13 in that sequence, which I could not fit on a note card, because it's 31 digits long, um, has 13 zeros, accordingly. 13 zeros on either side of the number. And I think that's the nail in its coffin, really, because you've already got the 666, you know, number of the beast. It's a beastly prime. Uh, and I'm sure everyone's aware, in Western culture, 13 is considered unlucky. It's got its own phobia and everything, triskaidekaphobia. Uh, and so, you know, 666, 13. What I also think is interesting about this number is that it actually has 31 digits, um, which is 13 backwards. And I know that's a little tenuous, <laughs> but it ties into the whole palindrome thing. And in my mind, what I always think of immediately is satanic panic. Because there was that whole thing with playing, if you play a record backwards, specifically rock albums, if you play them backwards, they have secret messages about worshipping Satan. So, again, tenuous, I know, but that's what it makes me think of. So that's why I chose Belfigur's Prime as my favorite mega number, because not only is it big and fun to talk about, but it's got, it's got all those zeros. It's got all those zeros. And, you know, it's Prime. Always a crowd favorite, palindromic, and uh, it's spooky is almost too strong a word, but it's got, I guess you could say, culturally significant aspects that you can tie into it, and I think that's fun. So yeah, it's a good, tidy, big, spooky number that uh, I really enjoy. So, thanks.